All right, today's little project, installing the rear sway bar in my 2016 Velosta Turbo. All right, well, sorry about that. I uh, got carried away trying to get this last bolt up in there. What I ended up having to do was unbolt the shock and drop this arm down far enough. For some reason on my car, this spring is right where the bolt is. So not enough room. So all I did was pull the bolt, drop the spring, put a pry bar between the spring and the pad, able to slip the bolt in. Now we're gonna put the shock bolt back in. See it hanging out over there? That's it right there. And then we'll put the bar in. All right, give me a second to Get that put back together. Oops. Okay. And then sorry for the reach. All right, I'm just gonna put that bolt right there. Yay. And now it's holding it, so I don't have to, having it keep drop on my forehead. We'll do this other side. As you can see, I got one in. We're gonna turn it. All right, let's see if we can get that other bolt back in that hole. Where is it? There it is. Sometimes, I guess you just get lucky.
retort the other side down just a little bit more so a job that should have taken about 30 minutes took me two hours mostly because between fighting with the rubber piece in here and the steel lip that I had to get around I had to drill out three of these to make it so the bolt would go through all right well, that is the rear sway bar install on a Hyundai Veloster. Will take you somewhere between 30 minutes and a couple hours, just depending on issues you may have or tools you may have available. Well, thanks for watching my video. Have a great day.